I had invited uh, some of my colleagues to come and join me yesterday in the constituency. I invited James Orango, the Senator for Sierra. I invited the MP for Ria Dr. India Molo. I also invited the MP for Nya, for Nya Kach. I didn't know. But uh, in the morning they had uh, they, they attended a function in Nya Tike, where one of our local council of elders was being buried. And so they arrived very late. By the time they arrived here, when they called me that they were taking off from Nya Tike, it was already very late. So they, all the events were already concluded. Uh, but at that time, when they were taking off, I was inspecting development programs in the school which is in that sub-location, which is known as Nyanganga Primary School. So I told them to come and land at the school where I was uh, going around. I was in the school to check the projects which I had already, been, which I had already done through CDF and also to see what other projects we can do in the coming future. And the school is intending to conduct some events, uh, some fundraisers, so I also wanted to uh, have my colleagues also be part of it. So as the chopper was uh, flying over, uh, and the chopper was landing at the school, uh, most many residents al around there were able to join me. And because the school is next to a market center, a market center, a lot of people came in, a lot of women came in. And uh, yeah, so as the chopper landed, uh, then the people were gathered and uh, we were trying to talk to them. They were saying, Jim, we have not seen you in a very long time. Come and tell us what uh, Baba, what Baba asked for us. So as uh, we were briefly trying to talk to the people, uh, uh, an, a parliamentary aspirant here arrived with, with goons. And the goons started uh, uh, throwing uh, stones and uh, throwing chairs on us and hurling abuses and insults. And uh, the decision became murky. And our security, uh, our security, uh, 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 body, uh, our bodyguard decided to evacuate us, and you could see from the videos that we were, we decided to leave the venue. Uh, so uh, what I want to say is that uh, I have seen that uh, the sections of the media may have captured the information in not the right way, and to paint that event as having been a BBI event, no, it was not a BBI event. We were not even able to get a chance to talk to the people because they, they, they hired you to become rowdy. And uh, I thank God because we were able to escape. Otherwise, uh, there would have been bloodbath in that place. I want to thank the, youth, the various youths who are there who restrained themselves from engaging in physical confrontation. As the few youths who are there, as you could see in the videos, not numbering even 10, were all over the, all over the place, uh, you know, doing all sorts of things as they did. In this era, when we have the handshake and we have the BBI process, and we are talking about the unity and peace in this country, we want to urge all politicians, all aspirants that peace is paramount. And it is important for all of us to observe peace, to ensure that we do not engage in acts of thuggery and violence that in turn could uh, damage the uh, the, the lives of our people. We really would like to condemn violence in the strongest sense possible.